Well, they're under the hood looking at this one. And this will be an interesting call here, Coach Fratello. Watch the right hand of Kawhi. Right hand on his hip. And then does the left hand of Kawhi get him on the elbow. Now, Paul George was called for the foul. It doesn't look like Paul George touched him at all. There he missed him. Kawhi taking a look as well. Clippers looking to snap a six-game losing streak. The Rockets come in, winners of six in a row. And there's been moments that have been very solid for the Clippers. The start of the game and the start of the third quarter. There's been a lot of indifference in between. One player that should be highlighted is Terrence Mann. Starting tonight, he was a starter coming into opening night. Ankle injury prohibited him from playing the first couple of weeks. And then the trade with Harden kind of jumbled everything up. But in a tie ball game, Coach Fratello, Terrence Mann, who has one point, is a plus 14 in the game. Because he makes good things happen through his energy, through the effort that he puts out there, puts his nose under the rim, pulls defensive rebounds out of there to give your team a possession. After review, there is no contact during the play to the basket. Therefore, there is no ball on the play. It is a successful challenge by Los Angeles. The ball was loose when the whistle was blown. Therefore, a play will be resumed at the center circle uh, with a jump ball you know, between two players, any two players. It is a successful challenge. Therefore, Los Angeles will receive another challenge and they will receive their timeout back. So, roundabout Clippers hold on to a timeout. They win the challenge, but because there was no reaction after the whistle blew, understandably so, there is no team that gets the ball. Had that ball been rebounded by the Clippers, they would have the ball. Same thing if, if Houston had rebounded. So now it is going to be a jump ball at center court. Look for the cup between Paul George and James Harden. If Zoo can get it, that's where he should drop it, between Harden and Paul George. But they've got to block out their man. Zoo has only won one jump ball this year. Whistle. And Derek Richardson, is he seeing there's a foul against Houston? And it goes on to Shin Goon. And that is his fourth. He doesn't lend much of an argument. Let's watch the left arm of Shin Goon pulling Zoo down on the right shoulder. Nice look by the official. Harden at the controls, looking to break the tie. Leonard picked up by Jabari Smith Jr. Doubled for a moment. Shot clock is malfunctioned. They don't even start it with 24. Zoo taps it up, but not in. This is gang rebound mentality here. Shot goes up, five black jerseys have to go on the glass to secure the basketball. Shin Goon. Tough shot inside. Rebound goes to Kawhi Leonard. And that's what you saw was five black jerseys in that lane area. George picked up by Van Vliet on a mismatch, but they center it back over to Leonard. Trying to get that spacing right. Kawhi, whistle. And a foul on the floor.